All right, Chance, tough finish to the tournament for you. Tough loss, one minute of riding time to Walsh, you dominated in the duel eight to four. You come out there, and then you gotta wrestle a true second match. How tough was the true second match to get through? I mean, it's just, it's a long day, you know, um, so after a long day like that, you know, you gotta keep your focus, keep your composure, and just finish the day. Um, you know, when you could have been done two hours before, and you end up being the last match of the tournament. It wears me, but uh, and it makes it the mental edge just a little bit more difficult. But you know, at the end of the day, it's just wrestling. You just got to compete, open up. Um, something I didn't feel like I did very well today. But. So you look at the guys, the 49, 57, the guys who are getting better training with you every day. They win the EWL. They do a great job. Um, you and Thomas are kind of the foundation of the team. They're building around you. You guys don't win, but other guys are getting better from you. What's it like knowing that you guys are the foundation, they're building around you, and guys are getting better because of you? Uh, honestly, you know, Ronnie Perry, one at 149, that's who I train with almost every day. That dude, uh, I, th I think the team actually is mainly built around him, uh, to be honest, uh, you know, with his work ethic and his leadership. So, uh, us training together every day, you know, when you watch teammates win and you lose, it's, I mean, it sucks watching, you know, losing, but when you watch teammates win, like, it's pretty, it's a pretty sweet feeling watching Clucker go out and get the stick in the finals, get the pin in the finals. I mean, you got to be happy for the dude. You, you know, they all work for it, you know, just as hard as you do. So, um, you know, I mean, I'm proud of the team I wrestle with every day. Um, you know, just thinking about when we won as a team today, I kind of like flashbacks of practices that we've had. And, uh, you know, I, I, I know our team deserves to win it because we have guys in our lineup like that that can go out and win it when, you know, Thomas and I lose. So, it's tough taking a loss for you, but is there still any doubt you can't win 165 in Cleveland? I know. I'm going to come get it. Get healthy. Come get it in two weeks. Look, today, you know, I, I had your 65 uh, semifinal with Qualis. He's clubbing. He's coming at you. He's throwing underhooks. He's coming after you. You hit a lat drop for a takedown. You didn't look like yourself going in this, you know, mid-second to the third period. I was thinking, man, he's big. He's cutting a lot of weight. Looking a little healthy. End of the season. What do you think was going on in some of those matches today where, you know, you looked a little... When did they're going to third? Yeah, the way it gets to you uh, a little bit, but I think I caught a, a flu bug. I'm still dealing with it. it so it's just, you know, we got through the conferences. We'll be, I'll be off at the Nationals. And that's, that's, that's all that matters. You know? Were you worried about that second place match there? Were you like, man, if I get third, I got to get a wild card? Was that a thought in your mind? No, nah, just go out and compete. Not really a thought. No. All right, man. Good luck to you. You got anything else for me? No, sir. Hey, man, thanks for the time. Good luck to you. Love watching you. Get healthy, all right? Thank you.